Hi there, this is Helen from HelenLindop.com and today I am sitting here in my pyjamas. Let me show you. There you go. So why am I sitting here in my pyjamas? Well, the other week on Facebook I just mentioned to my, my Facebook friends that um, I was a bit bored with seeing all these adverts in my Facebook feed from these um, apparent women entrepreneurs who'd, in the space of four or five years, gone from being completely broke, in debt, totally clueless about business, and now, amazingly, here they are running six-figure businesses. And um, I just thought, well, everybody's saying the same thing, everybody's singing the same tune. It's a bit boring, you know, and that's all I said on Facebook. And I got a massive response from a load of my Facebook friends saying, um, yeah, it is boring. Can we have something a bit different? Can we be a bit more real for a change? And then it kind of got worse or better, depending on, depending on how you look at it. Um, because people started saying, well, I consider it a good day if I get a bra and deodorant on. <laughs> now, these are business women. I guess they're being a bit tongue in cheek. But the, the point is that um, all these photos that you get of these women entrepreneurs, they're all airbrushed. And so often, as women, we're so scared of um, appearing on video looking less than perfect or appearing in photos looking less than perfect and I think it, it really holds us back so I said you know what I am going to do a YouTube video in hairnet and rollers and then I said no actually I won't do hairnet and rollers as I haven't got any and I wouldn't know how to roll a roller anyway so I'll do it in my pyjamas instead so here I am in my pyjamas just to prove that, that you know I'm real most of us are real and um, let, you know, just let's stop pretending. And I think the thing that really stuck out for me from that, um, that Facebook conversation I just mentioned is that so many people were saying, look, I think these women are fake anyway. So all this airbrushing and all this sort of, uh, you know, say, well, I, I've, got, I've got six figures, uh, a six figure business in just a few years. It doesn't ring true anyway. So they look great. They've got a massive, um, you know, Twitter following. And you think, well, is that really plausible? Have they just bought those? Maybe they have, maybe they haven't. I don't know. Um, but um, I think the days come on the, the internet and also on YouTube and definitely in small business. I'm, I'm talking, you know, the solo business, the self-employed business, the micro business. For us just to, to be a bit more real about it all, you know, let's stop pretending we're these huge entrepreneurs. Um, because, it, uh, you know, a lot of us, we're not like that. We're just trying to make a living. Um, you know, if we manage to grow a business into, you know, into our six figures, then fantastic. You know, I'm not knocking that at all. But that's so far ahead of where many of us start off that it just doesn't feel real. It's not something we can aspire to. And, um, you know, we, I think we're just quite tired of slick marketing and it's about time. That, um, that we were real and other people that we are, are looking to inspire us were, were real as well. So uh, that's my piece about being real. Um, if you've got any comments on that, I'd, I'd love to, to hear what you've got to say um, you know, below this video or, or on my blog. You know, you're, you're very welcome to do either. So, and if you want to make a vi video of you in your pyjamas or a hairnet <laughs> and rollers, just yeah, let me know about it. I'd love to see it. So thanks for listening and I'll see you again soon. Bye.